So if you get into some legal trouble, a lot of people end up going on the internet, talking to their friends, and all of a sudden you're exposed to legal terms that might confuse you. One of the popular legal terms you hear about in drug cases is constructive possession. What is constructive possession? Well, most of us understand the concept of possession. If I have something in my hand, I'm in possession of it. But is it possible to have something in your possession without having it in your hand? The answer under the law is yes. That's what we mean by constructive possession. If drugs are in a place that you have dominion, custody, or control over, you could be considered to be in possession of those drugs. That's why you have to be very careful, especially like if you get in somebody else's car and they ask you to go for a drive, you might have control over that car and not realize that you are in constructive possession of drugs hidden inside. Your backpack, your suitcase, don't think you can just go through the airport, throw your stuff in a luggage uh, somewhere, and once you've abandoned it, you know, to give it to the airport, you're fine. Constructive possession means that you could be in possession of drugs even if physically they're not in your hand. Carlson Meisner Hart and Hazlett, protecting your rights since 1971.